Hello everyone and welcome back to the Amerlin Study. I'm Jess, your Amerlin Seat, and today we're going to be watching Season 1, Episode 2 of Agatha All Along on Disney+. Plus. So let's do it. I'm very excited to get into the next episodes for this show and I've decided that I'm going to just basically like mainline this shit. I'm going to inject it directly into my veins so that I can be caught up on it and react to the next episode on Wednesday, like on the day. So that's going to be fun. You're going to get an avalanche of Agatha all over my YouTube channel. You're welcome. Speaking of my YouTube channel, make sure you smash the like button, subscribe to my channel because you think I'm cute and funny, and maybe turn on the notification bell. And don't forget that if you want to toss a couple bucks my way, I have a Patreon. And it would be really helpful because I do pay for a couple of things to do this and, you know, every little bit helps. So there's that. And now we're going to do a brand new thing real quick here where we look at a couple of comments from the comment section of the previous video. So if you have something to say, throw it in the comments of this video and maybe I will feature it in the next one. No one can say. So here we go. Comments ahoy. Okay, first comment came from Kevin Johnson. Thank you, Kevin. So rewatching at least the last two episodes of WandaVision will clear up a lot of your confusion. I I don't know. That might happen. Maybe not. But little things you might not have caught are the fact that except for Aubrey and the teen, all the people in the town were also townspeople in WandaVision. Uh, I didn't notice that at all, although I should have like clocked the kid because I mean honestly chanting in Latin was probably the biggest red flag on that one and then uh, as a matter of fact on the opening credits it shows their character names I actually did notice that while I was editing the last video I was like y'all are sneaky he also says that the end of Doctor Strange 2 would be helpful but not super necessary now that Agatha is out from Wanda's spell the show is going to take a very drastic turn I don't know what that means but I'm excited about it drastic is fun. So I'm here for it. Thank you for your comment, Kevin. I'm awkward and I'm sorry. Might help if I hit the right hotkey. So the next one is from Key of One. I only ask if you don't know anything about the cast for the show, don't look it up. Possible spoilers. And Jenny was gobsmacked in episode two and it was awesome. So I don't know now. Well, I guess we're going to find out. So that's exciting. Rapunzel says observe as Aubrey Plaza licks Catherine Hahn's hand. The wild justice face turns three shades redder. And ma'am, first of all, I am wearing foundation and you cannot see that. And number two, I do not appreciate be being called out in this way, girl. But you're not wrong. And finally, Mark dropped me some hearts. And so I dropped him some hearts back because I love Mark. And so that's the end of that. And presumably I will get better at doing those and being less awkward about it. Oh, my screen is all fucky. Ugh, that's all right. That's fine. We're learning. We're growing. It's not a big deal. But enough of that shit. Let's watch some fucking fantasy. We can skip the recap. I just watched it the other day. Circle sewn with fate. Unlock that. I, I, how am I going to fit that on a thumbnail? <laughs> I feel like I can relate to her mood right now very much, like every day. Be sure to tell the vengeance seekers I said hi. Take me to Lynch's Road. <laughs> Wait, what did he say? Take me to Lynch's Road. Lynch's Road? Is that what he said? She doesn't like that. Her little stubby pigtails are cute, though. Come again? The Witch's Road. Oh, the Witch's Road. Oh, that's just what real witches say to keep the amateurs out. <laughs> we will give you the thing you want the most if you make it to the end. And I can. I will. He seems pretty determined. She seems unimpressed. Road is no place for a kid. I'm 16. Oh, sorry. Teen. <laughs> I don't know where you heard about. Well, I'm exceptional. That's my point. <laughs> nice. Since I first showed up on your Salem days. One of my favorite you eras. One of my favorite you eras. I saved you from the spell you were on. <gasps> Still love that armchair. I mean. Would you please untie that kid? Don't get me wrong. He's got some serious guy liner going. Sounds like it's what you're missing too. Nope. Too risky. <laughs> no time. No, no magic oh. at all. Whose hair is in the locket? 
my theory, my theory is that locket belonged to her way back in the day. And the hair is probably a loved one, but maybe it's actually her own hair because it does look like it's the right color. So yeah, this is one of her belongings. That's hers. Who are you? My name is... Oh, what? Is that a W that went across her mouth? His I'm mouth? Trying. Oh, it looks more like an M. Stashing really? the brooch yes. in her bra. Right. Classic. Great place to store stuff. Hello. The bra. What is happening right now? <laughs> what the hell? Just what I was looking for. Scissors. Uh, you're driving. Uh, oh, okay. To get his ropes. Okay. I don't know how he's going to do that by himself, but apparently he managed. Was that Wanda's house? I don't remember how that show ended. I'm over here. How are you? <laughs> yeah, that must have been Wanda's house. Be cool, man. <laughs> Was that your boyfriend? Did you just like hang up on your boyfriend? Ever you are, coming there shall be. That's beautiful. No, it's <laughs> definitely not. Can you actually jot that down for me? There's a pen in the glove compartment. <laughs> Bring out a magical spark. This uh, is gonna go terribly, I bet. Stop. See if she knows the secret handshake. <laughs> no. It's like the Masons. Oh! Patty Lou! Oh. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me, Patty Lupone? Holy shit! I bet that's the one that uh, Jenny freaked out about. And actually, now that I'm thinking about it, she mentioned that Patty Lupone was in this. But of course, that information did not stick in my mind. That's freaking fantastic. So good. Mine is the location of some gold bars he may or may not have buried in our backyard. <laughs> he died on the 18th hole. <laughs> I think she senses the bullshit. There's something else. Uh. You've been under the influence of another. <gasps> someone you hurt for three years. <gasps> She's the real it's deal. It's not the first time. That's why you're here. I knew she sensed the bullshit. And I am not interested. Ah, beans. Wait, what? Your bank statement will say Lilia's leggings, but that's just my side hustle. <laughs> Her side hustle. She's doing like a hot pot next to the stove. I love that. And eat babies. Babies are delicious. Uh, <laughs> four hundred ten. I'm gonna walk the road. Dun dun dun. I survived. Yeah. Where's your power now? Who? Time to restock. Name a batter bitch in South America or Europe. Who is this <laughs> child? <I'm laughs> pet. Say hi, pet. Hi. <laughs> you exp all that power is yours to keep. She's got her on the hook. Reeling her in. Join me. Us. And return <laughs> to your... Okay. You blow out all your light bulbs, babe. Three of I gotta look that up. All right. According to my booklet in the Prisma Vision Tarot, which is gorgeous and you should go look at it. I'll find a link and put it in the description. Let me make a note. Tarot link. Maybe I'll remember. According to this, the Three of Pentacles. Okay, so will you let me find the. This is the Three of Pentacles in my deck. And the booklet says A mason lays his bricks expertly, eyes closed in concentration, developing a simple rhythm. He has already built up a considerable portion of the wall, and he has a long way to go before it's done. But he doesn't balk from the involved repetitive labor before him, trusting his skill to see him through to the end. Contented, undaunted, he happily continues his task. After the early stages of a project, there is a surge of pleasure in realizing you've achieved some tangible level of competency. Take pride in your work. Be meticulous and patient, giving credit to the noble endeavor you've chosen to undertake. Likewise, as each brick supports its brother, this is a good time to interlock your plan with other visions. Let other people's input influence your own. This is a great time to build stability and trust. Very interesting. I love that. Looks like you've got your coven. Whoop, whoop. You're on here. What? Whoops. I have his address. 
He's quite a sidekick, I have to say. Oh, Lilia, you're in trouble. Uh-oh, Crow. A harbinger of bad omens, perhaps? I just burped coffee. Sorry. Agatha, who's next on the list? Uh, Your mom. Oh. <laughs> Divine, right? So good. You're eating oh. wax? My probiotic candles are perfect for both ambiance and... Probiotic I candles, no. I'm fresh out of marbles and my pelvic floor is all over the place. <laughs> Sisterhood of the Traveling Kegel? No? <laughs> you look amazing. I know. <laughs> what do you I love her. Magic? You lost the dark hold. And now you're powerless and exposed. How what is the dark hold? Witch killer? Like I care about that dusty, warty, snaggletooth community. Oh. <laughs> you don't f have fun healing the healthy. <laughs> Who's this? Another child sacrifice? Oh. I'm really sorry about your recent legal troubles. <laughs> yes, I'm aware. Fraudulent <laughs> and resulting in consumer injury. Uh. Apparently, some people needed skin grafts. <laughs> I haven't been convicted of anything. We as a group don't do well in courtrooms. The charge has a surprisingly <laughs> lenient penalty. So you're magically bound, and you're about to get literally bound. <laughs> drama. You've tried everything but the road. I love this guy. I love this kid. Join us here. I would die for this kid. Oh. <laughs> Take a jade egg to go. You'll know where to find it. <laughs> Amazing. Lilia said four names. Let me see. Let me see. What are you? Come on, Katie. Oh my god, I could Blood kill for a corn dog right now. Holy bit. cow. Oh. R.I.P. I bet it's a limited edition, but it costs more than I make in a whole summer at the Hokey Pokey Bowl. The <laughs> Hokey Pokey Bowl. I want to go there. Have corn dog. <gasps> Another harbinger of doom, perhaps? I guess she lost a taste for her corn dog. Cooler Is this hot topic? I feel like it's hot topic. I know. Ironic. <laughs> more like iconic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! She set him up. Harkness, this is You're fired. Oh no! Her hair is fabulous. What if you could finally answer the question that has been haunting you for most of your life? What happened to mommy? <gasps> She's gonna be a tough one to crack. Tough not to smash. Crack. So close. <laughs> How far away is the road? Like, what's the drive time? What's the drive time? Where are you from? What's happening? Are you having a stroke? Oh, it's a spell, so he can't say it. Drive faster. Okay. <laughs> it is a very cute house. Oh my god, what a queen. Holy shit. We are going to see a lot of that at Dragon Con, and I might be one of them. A wolf? Symbolism out the asshole. Oh my god, she's a fucking icon. Jesus. She's not taking in her mail. Which I can relate to because I often don't bring in my mail. I got a nasty gram from the mail person once. Let me put it a little more to the Leave it I interest you in a old granola bars that didn't have much to work with. I ate before I came. You're bound. And you need a chemical peel. <laughs> this is not work. There was one more name on the coven list. Agatha the Green Witch. Because Agatha's name was on the list. What was the last name? It wasn't a name. It was a heart. A heart? A heart? A black heart. Uh, is Agatha the black heart? <gasps> what is happening? I know who it is. She's acting weird. Why is she acting weird? <laughs> Agnes? Ah. Uh. <laughs> My real name is Sharon. Well, there's no time for details. <laughs> oh, have I come? So, um, are we doing laundry together? Why don't you head upstairs and let us just do it? I don't take drugs. <laughs> oh, bunny. Oh, are the Salem Seven coming? Oh, no. I hope. Oh, no. Buddy, you should go back down in the basement. Am I supposed to know this song? Down, <laughs> down, down the road. Okay, that doesn't look good at all I protect that bunny with your life sir you need to take those paper towels inside uh oh uh oh okay it's like witch nazgul 
The curtains will not keep them out, I guarantee you. Oh. <laughs> oh, she's crying. Because that song slapped. That kicked ass. She wasn't so pitchy. Oh! I have perfect pitch. Uh oh. Sir, get in. Oh, get in the basement! Get in the basement! What are you doing? Uh, uh It worked! Was that there before? It was not. Sir, you need to run! Uh, you need to run. Go in the basement. What are you doing, sir? Creepy. Because we should really, really go like right now. <laughs> oh, there he is, out of here. <laughs> no way, I'm sick of. What does your gut tell you? Oh. <laughs> what does your gut tell you? Oh, that's. Oh, come on. Why? That was so creepy and fucked up. <laughs> Girl, go down the fucking stairs. Oh, it's gone, isn't it? Like, it's gone. Oh, yeah, you you done it now. You got what you wanted. Girl, you better move. I still want to know why she didn't want to bring the green witch. That is spoopy as shit. Amazing. I love it. Oh, he is so excited. Ugh, he's such a bean. Got a knife in there or something? Why are you, are you taking your shoes off? Why are you taking your shoes off? Oh, they have to take their- they have to go barefoot on the road? Oh my. <laughs> She's jumping around in the back. <laughs> I never doubted us for a second. <laughs> that was fun! That was so fun! Oh my goodness. So, I love all of the witches that she brought together. Patty Lupone, I'm losing my mind over Patty Lupone. The song was extremely cool and is going to be stuck in my head for the rest of my life, I'm fairly certain. And let's talk about the teen boy who we don't know his name. He is an icon. He is a blackmailing icon. He is a persuasive icon. I love him. And his entertaining game is on point, even if they were stale granola bars, like the little toothpicks. Very good. Excellent. 15 out of 10. No notes. The Salem 7 were creepy as shit. That was like literal weird ass Halloween Nazgul shit. Like, did not like. Especially when the one came down the stairs. Like, the ring girl. No, thank you. No, thank you. Uh, no stars. Zero out of 10. Do not like at all. And then I think that the Green Witch, sh what, she said her name was Sharon, I think. I'm pretty sure that's the mom from that 70s show, right? She's adorable. I love her. And there is a reason that Agatha didn't want to bring her along. And I think that it's, and talking about the black heart, what I think is that she is probably just absolutely terrible like black magic shit and when she gets her power back she's going to be an absolute menace and I'm extremely excited about it. That is my prediction for that. They're barefoot on the road. They had to take as we saw in the credits. They had to take off their shoes before they went on the hollow ground. So they did that. Oh my goodness. I can't wait to see the next one. I really cannot wait to see the next one. Holy crap. Holy crap. Also excited I got to bust out my tarot cards just for research purposes. That was fun. I don't I don't mess around with those nearly as often as I should. So, yeah, absolutely hooked on this. I cannot believe that I was thinking about not watching it. Like it did not initially pique my interest and that was foolish. I was a foolish person for not being like, "Yes, sign me up for this right now." <sighs> So exciting. Love it so much. Can't wait for the next one. I will probably record it today. I'm doing what the kids, I believe, call batch recording. And we'll see how that goes. So I think that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for stopping by. Until next time, stay hydrated and maybe don't bully your coven. <laughs>